Welcome back. Thank you for staying with us. Now, Christmas was celebrated differently in the port city of Mombasa as MV Nautica, a regular vessel at the port, docked with 570 tourists who got time to sample Mombasa's historical sites before traveling to other Kenyan sites. This is indeed a double boost to tourism happening just a month after another cruise ship docked with 800 tourists aboard. Elsewhere at the coast, Kenyans thronged social places including beaches to celebrate this year's Christmas. Tobias Chanji with the details. Seven in the morning, MV Nautica had already called at the port of Mombasa with about 570 tourists, mostly pensioners, will have a day-long port stay in Mombasa before venturing out to Tsavo East and West National Parks, while others will have city tours at the coast. We're different from where we come from, so we're interested in seeing whatever we can. Uh -huh. We're looking to the his history side of it today, so some of the old parts uh, around Mombasa. Dilip, Kuma, uh, Dilip Patel from Uganda. I'm visiting in Nairobi, Kenya. Kabari yako, Missouri sana. Thank you guys. Thank you, sir. The vessel is a regular call which had, however, been interrupted by COVID-19. It arrived from Port Victoria in Seychelles. Which I haven't seen for the last 50 years. I was in Mombasa on my way to India before I went to United States and stayed a day in Mombasa. But I've come to Nairobi lots of times. We did safari about 10 years ago and we enjoy Kenya, Uganda and Tanzania. After Mombasa, the vessel will sail southwards to the spicy Indian Ocean island of Zanzibar in Tanzania. But I have to say, even though I've been all around the world and visiting uh, thousands of ports, I think this is one of the most beautiful, if not the beautiest, ceremony I experienced ever. At hand to receive the vessel was Tourism Cabinet Secretary Penina Malonza. This comes less than a month after a similar cruise ship aboard 800 tourists, mostly students, arrived at the port for a five-day stay. The over today 572 on board who have made the magical Kenya part of their cruise uh, itinerary will have an opportunity to experience the new experiences, products, attraction that has made Kenya a world-class uh, tourist destination. I can without a doubt say that uh, out of the arrival of this cruise ship uh, today, over almost uh, 100 million will be injected in the economy through tourism activities, including visits to different attractions as well as accommodation. It is that season again that the coastal region is enjoying an influx of tourists, especially foreign and domestic. And as usual, some chose to go to the beaches that included the famous Jomo Kenyatta Public Beach, commonly referred to as pirates. The revelers came here to either swim, observe, or get entertained. Leo tumekuja pa Pirates Beach ku kujifurahisha, kujiburudisha. Tena kuenjoy ni manake ni December msimu ambao watu wanakuja kujifurahisha. Tobias Chanji, KT News, Mombasa County. Well, that story leads us to a short break. As we come back, we bring you the latest in the world of sports. Stay with us.